the news banditry father umbaka sent very serious message to nigeria military and police the news details umbaka also said that if buari puts the round peg in the round hole it will bring an end to banditry in nigeria the spiritual director adoration ministry enugu reverend father ejike umbako umbaka has provided a solution to banditry after sending a message to the Nigerian army and police. According to him, there is agitation in the military and the police. Umbaka stated this on Sunday while addressing his congregation. He said, people are not agitating for nothing. Urging President Muhammad Buhari to listen to the reason for their agitation. Umbaka also said that if Buhari puts the round peg in the round hole, it will bring an end to banditry in Nigeria. He said, children are being killed. Those that are being bombed are Nigerians. Nobody is going to give an award to a father or mother for killing his or her children. The solution is simple. Put the round pegs in the round O and banditry will die. People are not agitated for nothing. Listen to the reason for their agitation. Because even in the military, there is agitation. In the police, church, and family, there is agitation. Umbaka also cla only claimed, the Spirit of God is not happy with our leaders, and it cannot be quiet while Nigerians suffer. The Spirit of God is not happy with our leaders, no matter how they want to paint it. Even if all the men of God are silent, the Spirit of God cannot be silent. If the poor masses are crying, we men of God must cry with them because they call us Father. I cannot be calm and my children are being killed. Father Umbaka is sending a serious message to Nigerian military and police. He's telling them that there is agitation in the military and the police also. That they should, the President Muhammadu Buhari should try to listen to the reason for their agitation. People are not agitating for nothing. Our president should please listen to the reason why they are agitating. Our president should put the round peg in the round O. That will bring about an end to banditry in Nigeria. Banditry have been a serious case in our country, Nigeria. And the only thing that can happen is our president should put a round, the round peg in the round O. He should listen to the reason for the agitation. He should put the main thing at the forefront. He should put the plants on his tables instead of going about doing so other, some other things. Children are being killed. Children are being abducted. Parents are being killed. Those that are bombed are Nigerians. Nobody is going to give an award to a father or mother for killing his or her children. The solution is quite simple. If you want banditry to die, what you need to do is put the round pegs in the round O. Our people are not agitating for nothing. Listen to the reason for their agitation. Because even in the military, there is agitation. Even in the police, there is agitation. Even in the church, there is agitation. Even in the family, there is agitation. The Reverend Father claimed that the Spirit of God is not happy with our leaders. And it cannot be quiet while Nigerians suffer. Our president should please come to our aid. It should, it should bring up, have a listening yes to the reason why the people are agitating it should bring banditry to his table it should solve the issue of banditry father umbaka reveals solution to banditry the only solution is that our president should put the round peg in the round o as per people are being killed people are being put in a they are put in cold blood baths and this is coming in when father 
Umbaka is telling President Muhammad Buhari that fighter jets will only create more problem to Nigeria. He's saying instead of President Muhammad Buhari to focus on fighter jets, he should focus on building more industries in the country as fighter jets will create more problems to the country. Fighter jets will kill, will kill innocent souls instead of killing those that are causing insecurity in the states. If the president Then that will cause a lot of problems in Nigeria. The problems will involve killings of innocent souls and more agitation will rise up. Fighter jet does not does not mean that agitators will stop. Fighter jets can also only kill innocent souls and maybe few of the agitators. But if we increase the agitators, agitators we come up day in and day out. They will keep agitating. The only thing our president should do is put the round peg in the round hole. And this will curb banditry. This will curb insecurity in the nation. The, con the president should not try to, co to do anything apart from that. Because if he tries to do anything, it will be so harmful to the Nigerians. So we are pleading to our God president that you should please listen to the agitators. Give them a listening yes. And when you give them a listening yes, they will be able to solve this issue amicably, whereby there will not be violence, there will not be killings, there will not be banditry, insecurity will be curbed. So let us try and appeal to our president. And Father Umbaka is saying that the spirit of God is not happy with our leaders, no matter how they want to paint it, no matter how they want to do it. Even if all the men of God are silent, the spirit of God cannot be silent. If the poor masses are crying, with the men of God, we must cry with them because they call us father. Our president should please give the agitators listening ears. Thank you, my listeners, for listening. Do have a great day and God bless you.